guys, how are you doing? Welcome, welcome. As you come in, please say hello. Let me know that you are there. Um, if you're watching this on a replay, can you just type replay at the bottom so that I know that you watched it? Also, um, I am trying to grow my audience, so if you like my videos, please uh, like and share them. I would appreciate that. Let me just make sure. Oh, let me turn off the volume. So we are working on a graduation picture, and it says the tassel was worth the hassle. And um, oops, we've got the graduation hat, and then we're going to do our numbers right here. So uh, let me show you what I've got going on down here. And the rest is going to come from this transfer. Um, so if you have transfers, you know, you're always um, able to mix and match. That is the beauty of it. You don't just have to just um, use that one transfer. Um, just uh, get creative and um, mix and match. All right, so let's cut these off. Let me show you right here. These transfers have these uh, lines. Those are your cutting, your guidelines. Um, this is your transfer, so if you want to cut it smaller, you can do so, but uh, they just space them out for you nicely. So I'm going to go ahead and cut out everything that I am going to use and just put it aside. Okay. Uh, let's see. 2019. Goodness, I don't even know what year we're in, guys. <laughs> so, uh, 2019. I need the nine. The rest I'm just going to leave on there and then I'll cut them as I need them. But we're going to make this little board. It's not so little, actually. It's a 12 by 24. Um, let me put this over here. I'm going to put this over there. Yeah. All right, guys. So let's take this paper off. Hola, Bernice. As you come in, say hello, guys. Let me know you're there. All right. So I get these from Hobby Lobby. No, I'm sorry. Uh, no, yes, I did get, get it at Hobby Lobby. So um, I love these. I love the black ones. All right, guys. So, what I am going to do, I am going to get my fuzzing cloth, okay? It is very important to protect your, um, your transfers. A lot of people call them stencils, but we call them transfers. Um, so, we really need to make sure that we fuzz them and fuzz them well uh, in order to protect them and to protect our surface. If we do not fuzz, we risk damaging the transfer. The transfer can stick, because they're so sticky, they can stick uh, to your surface. Um, and the green will come off, the, the back, uh, the stickiness uh, can come off of the transfer and your, uh, your surface will be green because this stays behind. And it's all because uh, it's either fuzzing or you need to wax your surface and you would wax the non chalk couture um, chalkboards, uh, wood, anything like that that can damage your uh, transfer. So this is what I'm doing. I am. Voy a hacer. Ay, gracias. Me encanta todo lo que haces. Ay, gracias, Bernice. All right, so I'm going to put this right here. I'm going to stand up because I can't see if I'm making this straight on here. I'm gonna put it on here. Let me put this right here, guys. I can't see if I'm straight or not. So I'm going to put that there and let me just align everything and make sure that it is where I want it. Um, I'm 
think this might be a little big. Well, I don't know how I want this, guys. And if I want that there. Um, I'm trying to figure out. I wanted to put Love the Family, but I'm not going to do that. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put this down here and what do you think I think I'm gonna do that okay so what we're gonna need is our little stirring sticks because we need to stir our paste we need to make sure that it is not dry. If it is a little dry, it's okay. Just add a little bit of water. You always want to have a little spray bottle uh, close by. Okay, make sure that when you stir, to stir away from your surface, because believe it or not, I have stirred pretty fast and it has gotten on my surface. So you do not want it getting on your surface. Remember, you want it to be like a yogurt-like consistency, okay? Hi, Dina, how are you? Dina, do you have any graduations to go to? All right, so my white is perfect. And so I'm thinking I'm going to do um, the current jam. All right, so this one really needs some water. Also guys, please um, share my videos if you um, are enjoying them. Helps me grow my audience as well. All right, so I'm stirring it. I just need it to be a yogurt-like consistency. Also notice that I am stirring it oh, and I am away from my surface. I do not wanna stir and accidentally have a little bit of water uh, splash out. Um, yes, it can be done because believe it or not, I have done that before. All right. So I am going to make my, um, cap in white because I really need it to pop. And so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to grab my squeegee and I am going to put my white on here and then I'm going to go back and just pick up the excess. The paste, guys, goes a very long way, so you don't want to waste any of it. There we go. Make sure that you have clean hands. Oh, you have your nephew. Well, congratulations to uh, your nephew. Alrighty. Uh, let's see. So I am going to do this in um, in a messy look. So I'm going. What I'm going to do is I'm going to dab white, and I'm going to dab my maroon. And then I'm just gonna um, just go crazy with it. Just grab my squeegee and mix it all up. It's gonna be a, like a messy look, all right? So what I'm going to do is I am going to take the backing off and I'm going to fuzz it. Remember, it is very important to fuzz. Can't stress it enough. I myself have ruined some transfers because I don't, I didn't fuzz it well enough, or I forgot to fuzz it because I was in a hurry. All right, so let's let's put this back, 
And this would look good like at a gift table or anything like that. Hot mess, that's the name I'm thinking about. <laughs> Not the messy look, it's the hot mess technique. I was like, you know what, that doesn't sound right. Guys, I don't know what's wrong with me. All right, so let me put my letters just to make sure that everything is gonna be um, okay. Uh, I think I need to bring this down a little bit more. All right, what do you think, guys? All right. So here we go. I'm just going to dab the white everywhere. Now, I won't pick this up and save it, okay? Because um, I don't wanna put it in, mix it in with this these solid colors. If you have something else that you can put on it, I mean, put it in, then go for it, okay? All right, are we ready? And here we go. Is this cool? All right, guys, having fun with this. <laughs> I'm gonna get a little bit more white. All right, so I, like I said, I'm not gonna put it back into the jar, but I am going to lift it up and put it on this towel because I'm gonna throw it away. You can, if you have a little jar, um, you can put your paste in, on it, or in it, I'm sorry. But, um, actually, I don't know where mine are at. I do have some, because I was putting some sample paste in them. I just don't know where I put them at. All right, here we go. There we go. Man, I like that. I'm gonna dry this because I don't wanna accidentally touch this and I did bring the hair dryer this time and I used the cool setting, okay? Guys, and this is so much easier than using vinyl. I'm telling you. You don't have to cut it. You don't have to weed it. It's nice. Okay. Oops. All right. So, guys, if, if, you, if it's for a girl, you can even add, like, maybe some flowers or some sparkle or something. Um, if it's a guy and um, he was maybe like into baseball or football or basketball, we also have transfers uh, that have that and you can incorporate them on here or you can um, just get the, uh, you do like a 3D and buy the little footballs like at Michael's, Joann's and then hot glue them to your board. So you can really just um, dress it up uh, to uh, whoever it is that um, you're giving this to, okay? So get creative and get as creative as you can. Um, I'm more simple, so to me, like, this would be fine. Um, but that's me. Hi, Melissa. How are you? All right, so we're now just going to add the um, class of... 2019 move that so that you can see 
I'm gonna go ahead and throw all of this onto my fuzzing cloth so I can just pull them off when I am ready. And hopefully I put them in the right order once I put them on the board. <laughs> all right. All right, here we go. Now again, fuzzing is so important, guys. Very important. So I am going to do this in just white because I want it to be the white, the color, and then the class of 2019. And I do have one of those laser thingamabobs to make sure that I can do it straight, but it's a lot of work. It's a lot of work to line it up and everything, and I don't have the space for it because it's like a little L thing, so it shoots the laser this way and another one this way. Does anybody have that? Melissa, do you have that laser that I'm talking about? It's uh, from, um, gosh, what is the name of that um, company? I'm trying to think of the name of the company. Thing, um, memory or, gosh, I can't think. Let me see, I think I'm gonna have to cut them smaller. They're too big. And they're spacing out too much, so. What I'm going to do is I'm just gonna grab my scissors and just start cutting away. I don't wanna get too close. Oh, these are your nephew's colors? Very cool. Man, these, um, these numbers have a lot of um, transfer um, that I'm cutting off, so. Hopefully I'm does do they look straight guys? All right, one more to go. And that's it. Now, Melissa, do you have anybody that's graduating? All right, guys, I think I'm okay. I think. I think my two is um, needing to be a little bit closer. All right, I think I'm good. I'm gonna pick this board up, guys, because so that I can see. All right, I think I'm okay. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm just gonna get my squeegee, and then I'm just going to apply a little white, and then pick it up, and then I'm good to go, okay? 
guys, as you come in, say hello. Let me know you are there. Uh, please, if you don't mind, share my videos. That's how I grow my audience. All right, let me just bring take the excess excess off. There is something on that squeegee. There we go. All right, so I'm just gonna lift this up, make sure that you have clean hands. And then just pick everything up. You do not want your transfers drying, uh, your ink drying on your transfers, sorry. Um, have to be careful with the black, um, canvas because you can scratch the black of it off so you have to be very careful that's why I wasn't trying to push too hard on it but it looks like I did there we go all right so what I'm going to do now guys is I just I'm just going to take the hair dryer to it to it really quick and then, um, and then I'll show you what it looks like. Also, guys, if y'all take pictures, if you, you know, for your graduates, they can be holding this up um, as you're taking pictures, okay? So here it is. I'm just going to go up. And that is what it looks like. All right, guys. Um, that is it for me tonight. And I think that's it. Are there, are there any questions? Let me scroll real quick. All right, guys. Thank you so much for joining me tonight. I will see you tomorrow. Bye, guys.